Hi guys, welcome to a new video. Uh, today I would like to talk to you about uh, belt tension on the i14 2 car and uh, how I set up my belts. I have my car here um, and uh, in general I would like to say I would like to keep my front belt a little bit more tight than the rear belt. Uh, this gives um, in general a bit better feeling on power. I would say don't don't have your rear belt more tight than the front because then it can get a little bit loose on power because you get uh, the power on the rear tires before the front and it can be a little bit uh, tricky to drive. So in general I like to keep my belt tension uh, same or a little bit more to the front. So the front belt a little bit more tight than the rear. So which position should you have? I have here the drivetrain. And as you can see, you can use the middle position in the front. This is with the standard uh, eccenters. So I just keep it uh, in the middle position and the same in the rear, also in the middle position. One thing I tested um, uh, last couple of practice sessions and works very good. Um, sometimes you would like to maybe tight the rear belt a little bit more, but if you move one step more tight, it can be a bit too tight. So I like to keep it in the middle position and then I put a 0.2 shim under the rear uh, belt tensioner. So 0.2 shim under this one to make it just a little bit more tight, but you see it's still fairly free. It runs very good. And the front is still a bit, I would say just a tiny bit tighter than the rear. Uh, it's just uh, how you want to have it. Uh, I tried to put the um, picture in so explain how to do this shim but uh, this is a fair very good uh, setup just keep it in the middle sometimes you have to go one step harder in the front uh, after a few runs if the front belt uh, lose its uh, tension but I in general I would like to say it's better you change your belt than to tight uh, these steps too much because sometimes when you run your belt and it gets uh, worn out you you tighten this one but then it gets too tight and still it can slip because your belt is uh, worn out and then the car doesn't uh, run very good so try to keep your belts uh, fresh and uh, keep it in the middle position uh, that's my recommendation and uh, works uh, very good and I think this is the best uh, way to keep uh, your IF14 to uh, uh, perform the best on the track. So um, yeah, that's it for me today about the belt tension. Um, please check out the uh, Infinity website about the IF14 2 car or uh, contact your local dealer for more information. Uh, thank you so much for watching today and uh, see you next time.